hello everyone thank you so much for stopping by the channel in this video i'll be featuring some components for the female character i want to show you how to create some sort of complicated merges and so i will run you through a couple of the items we're putting together first show you the component outfits where you can pause and drop down the description to see all of them listed and then also you'll find the component transfer glitch in there as well and so we're going to be using some merge boots that go over pants. And so an example here would be for the Gorka suits. And so the merge boots we're using are under the Arena War shoes. We're using the green camo plated boots. So again, we're looking for boots that go over the pants because as you know, when you put boots and items over or under pants, it can create a different style of pant. And so that's the first tip I wanted to show you. And I just wanted to call out, of course, the merge boots and so for the second outfit that we're going to be putting together here I do want to show you a little tip or trick on that that way you know exactly where to find the outfit but we're going to be creating an outfit that has the orange deadline top and in order to get the orange deadline top on female you have to do something a little tricky <laughs> and so we're going to go under the biker outfits and you can find the biker outfits at the clothing store counter. Any clothing store will work. And then you want to put on the outfit that's called the Manchez. And so you will have a biker cut. It'll be the two-tone biker cut, so it's white and red. And then it has just a, a reg regular random kind of white t-shirt under. If you try to just put on a white t-shirt and the biker cut alone without purchasing it as it is at the counter, it will not turn into the orange deadline top. And so you have to do it this way. You have to purchase the outfit this way. And then you can change the gloves, you can change the shoes, the pants, um, you know, change everything else about it except for the top to get it to turn into the orange deadline top, which is what we're doing here. And so now I actually just wanna show you the actual components that we're putting together. So the last little tip or trick I wanted to show you is for the trash vest component. So you'll need to make sure that you put on under business shirts the white cuffed business shirt, but it has to be the one with the open collar. So just go to business shirts, scroll through, and make sure you have that one on. And then you need to put on the gray fitted suit vest. So like I said, I'll show you the full outfit components here in just a second where you can pause and kind of drop down, but I wanted to make sure you knew exactly where to find the items that I'll be listing in the description and that you understand exactly what I mean. Um, when I say that because they're a little bit hidden or confusing if you don't actually see me put them together So for the first outfit we're going to create we are going to feature components for the trash vest deadline top and whatnot And so we have the armor slot We have the orange deadline top slot and then we also have the Gorka suit and then the merge shoes with merge gloves And this is going to create some scuba suit pants So you'll see the results and how we set that up when we get back on female for the second outfit, I have two options. You can either use the belt or the armor slot to just put it with the skinny armor, or if you want to use the belt slot, which is number seven here, um, you can use that to create the torso one non-transfer component merge glitch with regular armor and then some headphones when you merge it. So same idea here. We're going to do the bottoms with the Gorkas. We have a top component and then the two options again for armor or the belt. And I'll show you what we do on female. So at this point, you're going to need to drop down the description or just do whatever component transfer glitch that you know how to do. I use the creator component transfer glitch, just to FYI, to transfer these items over to your female character. Um, if you have questions about that specific glitch, please ask them on that video. So when you load back into your female character, you'll want to save your current outfit if you have one that you like. And then I'm going to show you how we're going to actually set up the slots to merge here. And so... First thing you need to make sure you have <laughs> is under the um, stuntman suits, we're going to be using the black stuntman shoes with the white stuntman suit. And so we're going to be doing that telescope glitch with the bodysuit where we kind of glitch off the top, are left with the shoes, and then we add another top because we're going to be merging some raised gloves. And so I'm going to go ahead and save this stuntman suit. Um, after the last outfit slot that I had created um, for the second outfit that I'm going to be doing here. And then I'm going to make sure that I, of course, under racing jerseys, have the color or style of racing jersey purchased. 
So we're gonna go with the cherry motocross racing jersey. We're gonna add these gloves to that. And then also head back over to the counter. Make sure you have one of those bodysuits purchased. Literally any style of the bodysuits will work. Whatever you have purchased or unlocked is what you can use to do the telescope part. Also, go ahead and make sure you have an orange deadline suit purchased, and we're gonna save that orange deadline suit in the slot after the last um, component or the bottom slot um, for the orange outfit or the first one that's in, in order here. <laughs> so you'll see I just save it under the bottom, which is outfit five um, for this specific component slots. And so you can go ahead and add the gloves you're gonna be merging now. So we're just gonna add the black wool, the fingerless gloves onto this, resave it over that outfit slot, put on the bodysuit <laughs> one more time before we head over to the telescope and we are gonna to start to, uh, or we're gonna finish the items here on female character that's gonna allow us to merge on, on female. And so please don't get confused. I'm just showing you some tips and tricks on how to do this here. What you really need to just follow is the components again in the description and then how I actually merge them together here on female. So to do this glitch, you put on the bodysuit, you run at the telescope, hit right on your D-pad until you kind of stop and not look through it. It will remove the mask. And then you just want to select that saved outfit that we're going to be removing the top on. So we're doing it here for the um, black high top canvas stuntman shoes. You want to go to the top section immediately. Don't change anything else about this outfit. You want to first and foremost change the top. And so we're gonna do that with the racing jersey. You can actually select two different styles here. I think the boost and the cherry both look okay, but we're gonna go with the cherry. And so once you do that, you now want to save this slot over the stuntman suit slot. So you see we have our gloves with the racing jersey and then the black high top canvas stuntman shoes that we're going to be merging together with some scuba pants. So just resave that over the slot here in order. And now we're going to go ahead and start merging. So you want to start up a Rockstar created versus job called Crooked Cop. You need to set that to player owned clothing when you load in. Invite a couple of people. Shouts to Letha Lady and T who joined me. <laughs> I love you guys. So you want to do this in order. I usually do backwards to forwards. So you want to scroll from the stuntman suit and gloves you selected to bottom to top. And then I told you you have two options, armor or you can do the belt. And I'm just showing you here the same. We do the same thing essentially for the orange outfit where you scroll from the outfit you saved on female, scroll to bottom, then to top, then to armor. But we're going to go out of this, out of this job specifically with the skinny armor outfit. And so I just scrolled over to that armor slot for the red um, items I put together. So you just want to add um, an earpiece or a rebreather to your character, quit the job through your phone, and then when you load back into the online session, you'll be able to save this outfit. So pretty simple. If you do know how to merge, it can be a little complicated if you don't. And I, as I said, don't forget, I gave you two options there. I ended up going with the skinny armor one. I like that a little better than the bigger armor um, with the torso one merge. I'm just kind of over <laughs> merging torso ones at this point, so I tried something different. So let's go back into Crooked Cop again, set it to player owned clothing, and let's do the orange outfit. So I'm scrolling from the orange deadline outfit over to the bottom components, top components, and then back to the armor components. You'll see here that we created an outfit now with the orange scuba suit pants, the orange deadline suits or shoes, orange deadline top. We also have some skinny armor. We also have um, a trash vest and we also have gloves and then headphones on this. And so just a, a tip or a trick if you didn't know this, you can change the illumination style of the deadline suits or anything else that has color on it or lights on it. I turned it off. Um, turning it off makes this outfit look a little better so the orange actually matches and it isn't so neon. So just a tip or a trick if you did not know how to do that um, for your deadline suits or anything else that glows. And then you can go ahead and just save this outfit. So I hope you guys like this video. Um, this is more complicated merging. I'm trying to show you guys that are maybe a little bit more advanced that there's a lot you can do with components if you just write it down, <laughs> try to figure it out use multiple outfit slots. There's lots of components you maybe haven't used together or tried to figure out together before. So 
I hope this really helped those of you that are wanting to do more complicated things, but maybe don't have access to um, like Save Wizard or PC or just two consoles. You know, you still can create some really great outfits. So as a reminder, check the description for components. Slow it down, pause it, do whatever you need to do. But I appreciate you all stopping by the channel. Thank you again. Please drop a like and subscribe and I'll see you soon.